All right, let's do Grace. Uh, you got a fun fact? Okay, yeah. Um, actually, my love language is in the Microsoft Word font, Wing Tanks. And really? there is a documentary about me. Ah, uh, love languages. For years, scientists have tried to find what they are. For some, it's touch. For others, acts of service. But for one young woman, she can barely comprehend her own. I was 19 when I discovered that my love language was in the Wingdings font. Nothing makes me feel as alive as Wingdings. To me and most other people in the world, this does nothing. This is mostly weird and disgusting. But for Grace, this is very good. The sexiest thing a man can say is mailbox, mailbox, mailbox. Arrow with two pointy things. I mean, it's bad enough that I have to translate my own love language in Microsoft Word, but I mean, sometimes it just feels like I'm the only one. That's because she is. Science remains baffled about why this could have happened. Like on the apps, I'll ask everyone if they've heard of Wang Dings, and everyone kind of just thinks that I'm really into the Zodiac Killer. This is a big problem for her. I mean, I wish that I could be really into having someone play with my hair, or I don't know, flowers? I mean, why couldn't I have at least gone with the sans serif font? Why, what was, what was wrong with the Ariel? Why does it have to be wingdings? For some time, Grace walked around and tried to talk to cars to see if maybe they were her match or not. <sighs> Arrow with two things and triangle and mailbox and mailbox and mailbox and red square and Only time will tell if Grace will be able dancer? to find I mean, Mailbox, mailbox, mailbox in real life. Hey, uh, thank you so much for watching. We had a lot of fun making it and I hope you had a lot of fun watching it. If you haven't already, uh, why don't you go ahead and click subscribe down there um, and comment something that you like. Uh, it really mean a lot to us. <laughs> uh, have a great day.